to give back in any way I can. Being a Marine now, I feel like I have a more higher responsibility to do that because we serve to protect everyone. You know, we serve for our country, we serve for the people. And being that as a May, you know, your community can only see that through a military aspect. But I feel like with me going there on my personal time, doing my, my due diligence for them, it'll help them uh, get more hope for the future for themselves. I feel like they're supported by the community as well as by us as a military uh, for everyone, you know, not as you know, some guys that can't really come and talk to you. You can't come and reach out, you know, because that's what we're there for. We're there for support. We're there for guidance. And that's what we do. That's what they do here at the recruiting center. You know, we help people build up their lives to where they are happy with themselves. And so just the outlook of doing that to them, just like a slice of pizza, you know, can go a long way. Well, Rogue Retreat is um, housing for the homeless. So um, we have the urban camp round phase one and phase two. I mean, that's like ground zero. But what really makes us unique, it's not just housing, but we do case management and we really try to work with our uh, participants and our clients um, to successfully um, get them moved forward um, once, you know, they get into our our programs. Uh, he he is just a really innocent, sweet soul. Um, and he, I say that um, at the same time as everybody that knows Dan um, knows he is stu- his stubborn streak. Um, but there's something about Dan that just makes him so unique. Uh, he doesn't steal. He doesn't use uh, drugs. Um, he has like over 30 something years off of alcohol.